नमस्ते एवरी वन वेलकम टू योगा विद मास्टर डी एंड इफ यू आर न्यू टू द चैनल सो प्लीज सब्सक्राइब द चैनल फॉर मोर योगा प्रैक्टिस वीडियोस एंड मच मोर ओके सो आफ्टर द हनुमान आसना एज यू नो वेरी वेल वी आर स्टार्टिंग विद द बिगनर्स ओके फ्रॉम स्टेप बाय स्टेप सो आफ्टर द अल बेट वील पोज हनुमान आसना टूडे इज द डे ऑफ स्ट्रेंथनिंग योर बॉडी मैनी ऑफ द बिगनर्स है प्रॉब्लम विद द स्ट्रेंथ सो लेस वर्क ऑन द स्ट्रेंथ Let's start without wasting the time. Sit down comfortably. Make sure you have a yoga mat to block. One booster will be always good. One yoga belt next to you. Then you are ready to go. Breathe, inhale, exhale. Normalize your breath. Very gently join the palm in front of the chest. And just repeat in your mind that I will finish this class completely. I will try to do my best and I will do. Slowly bow down your head. Inhale head up, exhale release your arms. Namaste everyone. Now inhale. First straight your arms here fingers separate properly. Make sure remember whenever you will drop your palm down your finger will be separate. This is a basic things you need to learn always. Make a fist rotate your wrist. 1 2 3 we will go with the warm up. 3 reverse Two, one. Very good. Open the arms sideways. Fingertip on the shoulder. Roll your shoulder. Very good. One. Breathe. Two. Try to be comfortable. Three. Very good. Roll. Other way. Very good. Three. Two. One. Open the arms. Inhale. Raise your arms up. Exhale. Drop your palm down. Come to your knees. Table top position. Keep your fingers separate. Whenever you do table top position, you press your palm nicely. So also, it's gonna strengthen your arms. You can see here the arms muscles. Very good. Look forward. Slightly inhale. Look up to the ceiling. Arch your back. Exhale. Round the spine. Look at the navel. Inhale. Lift the chest. Arch your back. Look forward or upward. Exhale. Round the spine. Look at the navel. Inhale. Lift the chest. Arch your back. Look up. Exhale round the spine. Look at the navel. Two more time. Inhale, lift the chest. Arch your back. Look up. Exhale round the spine. Look at the navel. Inhale, look front. Exhale now. Push your hips backward. Very good. Keep your fingers separate. Look forward. Inhale, move your shoulder forward a bit more than your wrist, so you can stretch your wrist a bit. Exhale, go back. Inhale, forward a bit more again. Exhale, go back. Inhale, a bit more forward. Exhale, go back three. Very good. Go forward. Inhale. Exhale two. Inhale forward. Exhale, go back one. Inhale, come back to tabletop position. And this time, turn your fingers. Very good. Opposite direction. Very good. So your fingers are towards your toes, and your back of the wrist is on the ground. Very good. Stretch it nicely. Try to keep your arms straight the more you can. One, two, three. Four, five. Very good. Now release. Very good. Now very gently tuck your toes in. Lift your knees up. Come to downward facing pose. Very good. Fingers separate. This posture does not stretch your back of the body, but also this give you opportunity to strengthen your shoulder a bit. One. Keep your leg hip width apart. Your palm shoulder width apart. Fingers separate properly. Try to press your palm down on the ground. Press your heel down on the ground and lift your hips higher the more you can. You can look slightly forward or look towards your toes or look towards your navel. All are okay. Initially, it's fine. One, two, three, four, five. In today, in our position. In the sun salutation, we will add a posture which is called plank pose. So feet together here first. Very good. Now look forward. Inhale from here. You can move your shoulder forward, and this is plank pose. When your shoulder is over the palm, okay, over the wrist, and your body is completely straight like a plank. Exhale, go back. Three times you can do. Repeat this. Inhale, move forward. Very good. Plank pose. Exhale, go back. Very good. Mountain pose. Inhale one more time. Go forward. Plank pose. Exhale. Go back. Very good. Now from here in this position, when we will be in the plank pose, we will drop the knees down and then push your hips back and then move your chest forward and drop the chest between the palm. This position. Toes pound out. Inhale. Lift the chest slightly up. Exhale. Go down. Push your hips back. 
Very good. Come to mountain pose again. Inhale, slowly come back to plank pose here. Very good. Drop the knees down on the ground. Exhale, chest and chin down. Very good. On the ground. Toes out. Inhale, lift the chest up. Exhale, push your hips back. One more time, plank pose. Inhale. Now drop the knee down, chest and chin down. Toes point out. Inhale, lift the chest. Exhale, push your hips back. Child pose here very nicely. Breathe, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, head up. Now tuck your toes in, lift your knees up. Come to downward facing dog with legs apart slightly. Very good. Now walk your leg forward between the palm. Very good. Head up, look up, lengthen. If you are a very beginner, your legs are going to be apart always. It will be a bit more easier for you, more comfortable. You can use the block anytime you want to look forward. Keep your kneecap lock nicely. You can feel the stretch on the back of the leg. Look forward. Three, two, one. Hold your elbow, hang your body down here. Very good. One, two, three, four, five. Very good. And now slowly, slowly stay here first. Now drop the palm down. Take your right leg back. Back leg is straight completely here. This is called high lunge, okay? But our palms are down on the ground. So just you can see the alignment gonna be fine. Your palm, your leg, your left foot is between the palm. Knees is over the ankle, thigh parallel to the ground. Back leg is completely straight, remember that. Now switch your leg, right leg forward and take your left leg back. Your legs are aligned with the hip joint always. Very good. See the alignment again, knees over the ankle. Back leg is completely straight. Very good, and look forward for three, two, one. Now inhale again, take your left leg forward, take your right leg back. Look forward, very good, for three, two, one. One more time, switch the leg, right leg forward, left leg back, very good. Come to here again, very good, look forward for three, two, one. Now drop your palm down and take your right leg back. Now feet together here, come to plank pose. This is how you can Check the distance very nicely. Your distance is going to be always fine. Now drop the knee down, chest and chin down. Toes out, inhale, lift the chest up slightly. Do not lift so much. Very good. Keep your arms bent slightly, back strength. Exhale, push your hips back, come to mountain pose. Inhale, walk your leg forward between the palm. Head up, look up, lengthen your spine, look front. Exhale, head down to the knees. Slowly, slowly here. Very good. Five, four, two. Slowly, slowly now. Feet together. Engage your kneecap. Very good. Slowly, slowly engage your quadricep muscles. Very good. Round the spine and slowly come up to a standing position. Samasthiti, roll the shoulder back. Very good. Palm by the side of the body. So feet together. Nicely active leg. Engage your core muscles. Roll your shoulder back and down. Palm by the side. Look forward. Breathe, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Now we will do five round of this sensory rotation. Make sure five round is minimum. I will say it's a very important sensory rotation, the most important part of the complete yoga practice, which help you to strengthen, flexible, move your all the joint, move your whole the system, your blood circulation, everything. So do not skip that part, okay? Make sure before you jump into the asana, five round is always important. Feet together, front of the mat, very good. Join the palm in front of the chest. Inhale, raise your arms up, look up, very good. Exhale, bend forward, extend your arm forward, come down, catch your ankle, head down to the knees. Drop your palm down, very good, take your right leg back. As I said, we are going to strengthen, so we are going to do this posture today, very good, high lunge pose. Inhale, raise your arms up, look forward, nicely balance. Remember the front knees is over the ankle. Exhale, drop the palm down, take your left leg back, feet together here, very good. Drop the knee down, chest and chin down. Toes out, inhale, lift the chest up. Exhale, push your hips back. Inhale, take your right leg forward between the palm, very good, or align with the hip joint, very good. Look forward, slowly raise your arms up. Inhale, exhale, drop the palm down, take your left leg forward, head down to the knees. 
Inhale, come all the way up, arms up, look up. Exhale, join the palm in front of the chest. Inhale, raise your arms up, look up. Exhale, bend forward, catch your ankle head down to the knees. Inhale, take your left leg back. Very good, look forward, back leg is straight and raise your arms up nicely, slowly, very good. Exhale, drop the palm down, take your right leg back, feet together, plank pose. Drop the knee down, chest and chin down. Toes out, inhale, lift the chest up. Exhale, push your hips back. Inhale, take your left leg forward, very good, look forward, very gently raise your arms up. Exhale, drop the palm down, take your right leg forward, catch your ankle head down to the knees. Inhale, come all the way up, arms up, look up. Exhale, join the palm. Inhale, raise your arms up, look up. Exhale, bend forward, catch your ankle head down to the knees. Drop the palm down, take your right leg back, back leg is straight completely, very gently. If you are not comfortable with arms up, you can be stay here. Raise your arms up, look front. Exhale, drop the palm down, take your leg back, feet together, plank pose. Drop the knee, chest and chin down. Toes out, inhale, lift the chest up. Exhale, push your hips back. Inhale, take your right leg forward, back leg is straight very gently, raise your arms up. Exhale, drop the palm down, bring your left leg forward, head down to the knees. Inhale, come all the way up, arms up, look up. Exhale, join the palm. Inhale, raise your arms up, look up. Exhale, bend forward, catch your ankle, head down to the knees. Drop the palm down, take your left leg back. Back leg is straight, raise your arms up, keep your legs active nicely. Exhale, drop the palm down, right leg back, feet together. Drop the knee down, chest and chin down. Toes out, inhale, lift the chest. Exhale, push your hips back. Inhale, take your left leg forward. Right leg is straight properly. Inhale, raise your arms up, look forward. Exhale, drop the palm down, take your right leg forward, head down to the knees. Inhale, come all the way up, arms up, look up. Exhale, join the palm. Third round, inhale, raise your arms up, look up. Exhale, bend forward, head down to the knees. Drop the palm down, take your right leg back, back leg is straight, front knee over the ankle, raise your arm up, look forward. Exhale, drop the palm down, take your left leg back, feet together. Drop the knee, chest and chin down. Inhale, lift the chest up. Exhale, push your hips back. Inhale, take your right leg forward, back leg is straight, raise your arms up, look forward. Exhale, drop the palm down, bring your left leg forward, head down to the knees. Inhale, come all the way up, arms up, look up. Exhale, join the palm. Inhale, raise your arms up, look up. Exhale, bend forward, head down to the knees. Drop the palm down, take your left leg back. Back leg is straight, look forward and raise your arms up nicely. Exhale, drop the palm down, right leg back, feet together. Drop the knee, chest and chin down. Toes out, inhale, lift the chest. Exhale, push your hips back. Inhale, take your left leg forward, right leg is straight, look forward, raise your arm up, look forward. Exhale, drop the palm down, right leg forward, catch your ankle, head down to the knees. Inhale, come all the way up, arms up, look up. Exhale, join the palm. Very nice. Fourth round, inhale, arms up, look up. Exhale, bend forward, head down to the knee. Drop the palm down, take your right leg back, back leg is straight, look front and raise your arm up. Exhale, drop the palm down, left leg back, feet together, plank pose. Drop the knee down, chest and chin down. Toes out, inhale, lift the chest up. Exhale, push your hips back. Inhale, right leg forward, look front, raise your arm up, look front. Exhale, drop the palm down, left leg forward, catch your ankle, head down to the knees. 
Inhale, thumb all the way up, arms up, look up. Exhale, join the palm. Inhale, raise your arms up, look up. Exhale, bend forward, head down to the knees. Inhale, take your left leg back. Look front, raise your arm up, look front. Exhale, drop the palm down, right leg back, feet together. Drop the knee, chest and chin down. Inhale, lift the chest up. Exhale, push your hips back. Inhale, left leg forward, right leg back, look front, very good, raise your arm up, very good. Inhale, exhale, drop the palm down, right leg forward, catch your ankle, head down to the knees. Inhale, come all the way up, arms up, look up. Exhale, join the palm in front of the chest. And now last round, each posture holding for three count, so you can feel that strength and try to feel which part of the body you are feeling here right now. Your legs can be slightly apart always. Join the palm, inhale, raise your arms up, press your heels down, pull your arms up, look up, activate your legs, activate your arms, activate your whole body from heel to fingertip, one. Two, three, exhale, bend forward, catch your ankle, head down to the knees, slowly, slowly, one. Two, three, drop the palm down, take your right leg back, your back leg is straight completely, front knee over the ankle, look front very nicely, raise your both arms up, look front, one. Two, three, exhale, drop the palm down, take your left leg back. Plank pose, fingers separate, Arms is straight, leg is straight. Engage your core muscles for three. Two, keep breathing. One, drop the knee down, chest and chin down. This posture we're not gonna hold. Toes out, inhale, lift the chest. Slightly use your back strength. Engage your glutes, one. Two, three, exhale, push your hips back. Come to mountain pose. Press your palm, fingers separate. Press your heel, lift your hips higher, two. One, inhale, take your right leg forward between the palm, back leg is straight, look front, very gently raise your arms up, one. Two, three, exhale, drop the palm down, bring your left leg forward, catch your ankle, head down to the knees. Breathe, inhale, exhale, three, engage your kneecap, two. One, inhale, come all the way up, arms up, look up. Very good, look up toward the ceiling, very good. Pull your arms up, press your heel down, three. Two, one, right away, go down, catch your ankle, head down to the knees. Breathe, inhale, exhale, one. Lean slightly forward towards your toes, two. One, drop your palm down, take your left leg back. Look front, very good, front knee over the ankle, raise your arm up, remember the alignment always, one. Two, three, drop your palm down, take your right leg back, feet together, plank pose. Press your palm down, lift your shoulder, engage your core muscles, two. One, drop the knee down, chest and chin down. Toes out, inhale, lift the chest up slightly, very good, engage your glutes, very good. Use your back strength. Two, one. Exhale, push your hips back. Come to mountain pose, press your feet, press your palm, very good, lift your hips. One, two, three. Inhale, take your left leg forward between the palm, knee over the ankle, back leg is straight. Look forward and raise your arm up. Very good, one, two, Three, exhale, drop the palm down, take your right leg forward, catch your ankle, head down to the knees. One, two, three, very good, right away from here, now we're gonna feet together, very good. Bend the leg at the knee, look front here. Make sure your knees do not cross your toes, very good. Inhale very gently, raise your arms up. First look down, so between the kneecap you can see your big toe. If your kneecap is crossing over the big toe, so go a bit backwards, adjust your body. One. Look forward, very good, fingers separate, arms are straight, shoulder back and down, neck free to move. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Drop your palm down, take your right leg back again. 
Very good. So this is the position, the most important position today, as a basic position. Very good. Look forward. Inhale. Raise your both arms up. Look front. Very good for five. Four fingers separate. Pull your arms. Very good. Three, two, one. Drop your palm down. Take your right leg forward. Left leg back. Back leg is straight. Look front. Inhale. Raise your arms up. Very good. One, two, three, four, five. Drop your palm down. Take your left leg forward. Head up. Look up. Lengthen your spine. Very good. Lengthen your spine. Look front. Inhale. Exhale. Head down to the knees. Inhale. Come all the way up. Arms up. Look up. Very good. Pull your arms up. Very good. Exhale, join the palm in front of the chest, release your palm, palm by the side of the body. Relax, normalize your breathe. So this is our sun salutation and two postures, very good, which can help you to strengthen your complete body. Now inhale, raise your both arms up, interlock your finger, turn your arms. Feet together, inhale, now lift your heels up, so just it will help you to strengthen your calf muscles, one. Very good. Higher the more you can. Also, yoga says this posture can help you to increase your height. Two, breathe. Three, four, five. Down, very good. Inhale again, lift. Five times, we will repeat dynamically. Exhale down, inhale, lift. Exhale down, two. Inhale, lift. Exhale down, three. Inhale, lift. Exhale down, four. Inhale, lift. Exhale, down five. Exhale, release your palm. Now bend the leg at the knee. You can touch your knees here. Very good. Inhale, raise your arms up here. If you want, if you are OK, first look down between the kneecaps so you can see your toes. Your knees is not crossing the toes. You can lower the hips down more, but make sure knees do not cross the toes. Very good. Inhale, straight your leg. Raise your arms up. Exhale, lower the body down. Very good, come down. You can keep looking at your big toe, that's fine, to learn the alignment. Inhale, come up again. Very good, look front. Exhale, go down. Your shoulder may be painful. Inhale again, lift up. Straight your arm, straight your leg. Exhale, go down. Inhale, straight your arms, straight your leg. Exhale, go down. Now drop the palm down. Head up, look up, lengthen your spine. Legs slightly apart. Very good. Exhale, hold your ankle, head down to the knees. Inhale, look front. Now take your leg forward, come to the front of the mat. Very good. I will start with the left leg, okay? You can also start with the left leg. That's going to be fine. We're going to change the leg. That's not a big deal. But you can see this posture easily from here. Inhale, take your left leg back. Very good. Now you can pl place the block, if you have the block, you can place the block out to side of the right foot. Very good. Drop the left heel down and push the outrage on the ground. And here. Try to lower the hips down and try to push your right knee against your right arm. Then raise your left arm up here. Or if you want, you can also here. That's fine, no problem. One. Two, lower the hips down slightly, but not so much. Two, knees over the ankle, thigh parallel to the ground, and you can look up. One, two, three, four, breathe, five. Now slowly drop the palm down, very good. Tuck your toes in here, very good. Change your leg, left leg forward, right leg back. Now you can see the back side of the body here easily. Very good. Now place the block out to side of the left leg. Drop your heel down. Push the outer A's nicely. Back leg completely straight. Front knee over the ankle. Your arms is right next to the sin bone nicely. Thigh pallet to the ground. Very good. Lift the chest and raise your arm up here or over the ear. One. You can look up. Shoulder away from the ear. Two. Completely side body stretch. Three. Parsukonasana. Four. Five. Now drop the palm down. Very good. Take your right leg forward. Now feet together here. Very good. Bend the leg at the knee. Look front, touch the ground, and raise your arm up. Look front. One. Back will be slightly arched. That's fine. Two. Three, but do not arch so much. Four. Five. Drop the palm down. Very good. Inhale. Take your left leg back again. 
front knee is over the ankle, drop the heel down, outer edge down properly, very good here. And now slowly come up without disturbing your leg and open the arms. Very good, arms aligned with the shoulder and then lower the hips down, look at the right palm. This is called Virabhadrasana B. One, two, keep your legs active. Three, very strong posture. Four, five, drop the palm down, very good. Take your left leg forward. Right leg back. Drop the heel down, very good. Same like last posture alignment. Knees over the ankle, thigh pedal to the ground. Back leg completely straight. Inhale, come up slowly, very good. Exhale, open the arms. You can see arms away from the body. Look at the left palm, one. Keep your arms active, your legs active. Back is straight, three, four, Five, drop the palm down, very good. And this time, take your left leg back, come to downward facing dog. Very good, breathe, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, two. Inhale, exhale, three, four, five. Inhale, walk your leg forward, between the palm, head up, look up, lengthen. Exhale, head down to the knees. Inhale, come all the way up, arms up, exhale, release your arms. One very nice, common and easy posture, which is gonna check your hip flexors strength. What to do is very simple, palm on the waist, bend the leg at the knee here, very good. So your thigh is pellet to the ground right now, and then from here, without disturbing anything, straight your leg. One, two, make sure your both legs are straight, body is straight completely, two, Three, four, five, down, very good. Change, bend the left leg at the knee, lift it up here first, thigh pelt to the ground, and then it's straight. One, two, three, four, and five, and down very nicely. Now slowly come down to the child pose. Knees down the ground, arms by the side, and head down. Nicely, this posture is very good. Relax here. Here now, sit down in the Bajrasana. So whatever we had done, the strengthening posture, whenever we talk about the strengthening, primarily we are trying to target the quadricep muscles. So this Bajrasana is a very good posture and which help you to counterpose your quadriceps, which is stretch your quadriceps here a bit, very good. Inhale now, raise your both arms up. Exhale, drop the palm down, come to your knees here. Knees slightly hip width apart, palm under the shoulder, toes point out. Now tuck your toes in, push your hips back. Now we are going to develop the arms strength. Very good, so look forward, inhale, move your shoulder forward, and slowly bend the arms at the elbow, drop the body down, very good. Come to the half chaturanga. Inhale, lift up, exhale, go back. Uh, remember in this position, your elbow is not going out, your elbow is close to the body, okay, so this way. So if this first finger is pointing front side completely, and then you are keeping the elbow inside your body, okay, close to your body, and then going down. Many times we're trying to do like a gym kind of stuff, that is not what we're doing right now. Here, again, get check properly, very good, inhale, move your shoulder forward, very good, bend the arms, elbow close to the body, lower the body down. Inhale up, exhale, go back. If you have block and if you are hard with this position, you can place these two block here and can drop the shoulder on the block which will give you a very good idea. Here, again, finger separate, inhale, like this, move your shoulder forward, exhale, drop your shoulder on the block. Inhale up, exhale, go back. Few days try with the block, then remove the block, will help you a lot. Five time, again everybody, inhale, move forward, exhale down, inhale up, exhale, go back. Inhale, move forward, exhale down, inhale up, Exhale back, inhale, shoulder forward, exhale, drop it down, inhale, lift up, exhale, go back, three, inhale forward, exhale down, inhale up, exhale back, four, last time, inhale forward, exhale down, try to hold, three, two, one, inhale up, exhale back, very good. Now knees apart, toes together, arms straight, head down, child pose, if you have block, you place the block here, and place your palm on the block, and drop your head down like this. One, two, three, four, five. Inhale, head up, exhale, release, very good. One more time, very good. Now from here, 
from the tabletop position, very good, you can straight your right arm forward and left leg back. So right now you are on your left one arm only. It will help you to strengthen your arm strength. One, two, three, keep your arms and legs straight. Four, five, change. Left palm, right palm down, left arm is straight and right leg back. Look front, one, pull the arm forward, leg backward. Two, three, four, five, palm down, knees down. One more time, repeat, right arm forward, left leg back. One, two, three, four, and five. Palm down, knees down, change left arm forward, right leg back. One, two, three, four, five, palm down, knees down. Now from here, tuck your toes in, lift your knees up. Very good, come to downward facing dog. Inhale, lift right leg up towards the ceiling. Exhale, take your right leg forward between the palm. Very good, drop the back heel down, out raise down. Very good, open the arm here. This posture we practiced before. And then come up slowly to Virabhadrasana B. Look at the right palm. Very good, now exhale, drop the palm down, leg back, a little bit flow. Plank pose. From plank pose, very good. You can all the way go down, lay down, very good, on the ground, and then push your body away from the ground, plank pose, it's hips back, come to mountain pose. Inhale, lift your left leg up towards the ceiling, take your left leg forward between the palm here. Drop back heel down, very good, right arm up, inhale here first, and then slowly come up to Virabhadrasana. B, from here, inhale, exhale, drop the palm down, take your leg back, come to plank pose. Lower the body down, lay down. Inhale again, push the body away, come up. Exhale, push your hips back. One more time, right leg up, inhale. Exhale, right leg forward between the palm. This time, inhale, both arms up, inhale. Exhale, drop the palm down, very good, drop the heel down. Very good, left arm up, inhale. Then come to Virabhadrasana B, look at the right palm. Drop the palm down, take your leg back. Come to plank pose. Lower the body down, lay down. Inhale, come up. Exhale, hips back. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, left leg forward. Look front, raise your both arms up. Exhale, palm down. Very good, heel down and raise your right arm up. Slowly inhale, come to Virabhadrasana B and then drop the palm down, take your leg back, come to plank pose, and this time hold the plank pose, one, two, three, four, five. Now drop the knees down, cross your ankles, sit down nicely. Very good, leg is straight. Now, even we are doing the strengthening, or whatever we are doing, we cannot skip the basic postures. Basic posture means basic bend forwards and twisting, Okay, so what we are going to do, we're gonna bend forward first. Feet together or slightly apart, as I mentioned before. For a beginner, slightly open will be always good. Inhale, raise your arms up. Exhale, catch your ankle. Inhale, lift the chest, keep your back straight, look up. And exhale, elbow to side and head down, slowly, slowly. Do not hunch your back. Try to come down with breathe. One. Two, three, four, five. Inhale, head up. Exhale, release your arms, palm down, very good. Inhale, very gently, now cross your ankle here. Very simple twisting, open the arms sidewise. Exhale, take your left palm to the right knee, right palm behind the buttock right away. Inhale, lift the chest up, exhale, twist. Look back to the right shoulder, one, two, Three, four, five. Inhale, open the arms sidewise, and exhale, other side, right palm on the left knee, left palm behind the back, and look back. Three, two, one. Inhale, look front, open the arms. Very good, now drop the palm down, come to your knees. Very good, take your leg back, come to plank pose, and then lay down. Now we will talk about the back strength. Back is a very important muscle, okay, and as everybody work a lot on the chair, Okay, and we have a back pain, so this will help you a lot. So lay down completely first on the ground. Very good. What to do is, 
Place your palm by the side of the chest. Legs slightly open, our feet together. Both are okay, fine, no problem, your choice. Inhale, roll the shoulder back. Shoulder away from the ear, and slowly, slowly lift your chest up. But do not straight your arm. If you straight your arm, so I will say, lift your palms above the ground. One. Look front, you can feel your back muscles. Two. Three. Try to lift more higher. Four. Five. Exhale down, very good. Relax, we will do counter pose later on. Very good, one. Two. Three. Now straight your arm here, very good. Look front. Inhale, lift the right arm up. And left leg up. Look front, very good, one. Breathe. Two. Three, four, five. Very good. Change. Left arm up, right leg up. One, two, three, four, five. One more time. Right arm and left leg. One. Higher the more you can. Keep your legs as straight and active. Very good. Two, three, four, five. Very good. Left palm, right leg. Very good. One, two, three, four, five. Exhale down. Relax, normalize your breathe. One, two, three, four, five. Palm by the side of the body. Very good. Now we are trying to strengthen our core muscles, so tuck your toes in. Very good. And push your body away. Come to plank pose. Try to push away from the ground. It will strengthen your whole body, by the way. Very good. But primarily your arms, shoulder, and your core muscles. One. With each exhalation, engage your core muscles. Two. Breathe is very important here. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Drop your knees down, push your hips back, head down, come to child pose. Very good. Relax, normalize your breath. One, two, Three, four, five. Inhale, head up. Exhale, lay down completely on your belly very nicely. Very good. One more time, we will again strengthen the core muscles. Very good. Now, take your toes in. Inhale, again, lift your body up. Come to plank pose. Very good. Try to lift higher away from the ground, but do not lift your hips higher, okay? Hips will come down completely. Your head to heel will be completely flat. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Lower the knees down, push your hips back, head down very nicely. Very good child pose. One, two, three. Four, five. Inhale, head up. One more round. I will say at least three rounds you should do, okay? Every single posture, if you want to strengthen your leg, you can repeat three times. Every single posture, if you want to strengthen, like suppose your core muscles, and you're trying to do the plank pose, I will say three rounds at least you need to do, okay? One round, ten breath is not enough, I will say. Okay, so three rounds, try to repeat. It will help you to understand more about the posture, okay? And you can do with the time. You can feel the posture nicely. Very good. Palm down, and definitely in this third round, you can feel this posture more. Very good, palm by the side of the chest, elbow by the side of the body, tuck your toes, lift your body up, very good, plank pose, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Ten. Very good. Now slowly, slowly lower the body down, lay down, push your hips back, come to child pose. Breathe, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale, two, three, four, five. 
Now we strengthen the core muscles whenever we talk about the core muscles, make sure this rectus abdominis, the back muscles, but with that we have obliques. Okay, so we will do with the obliques. So if you have already, you are tired, okay, you are very new in yoga and you're feeling shoulder is tired, then you can come to the forearm position, okay. Otherwise, straight arms will be more interesting and it will develop your shoulder strength, your arm strength as well. So we are having two options, okay. First basic option is your forearm is down like this way, okay. You can make a fist and then you are here on the side body. You can put your top leg in the front a bit, then raise your arm up and stay here. Very good, we're gonna do for 10 count, okay. Otherwise, you can be simply with the same thing, plank pose, and then raise your arm up, try to move your hips away from the body, away from the ground, sorry. Very good, and look at your right, left palm. If you can't look there, no problem, look straight, that's fine, you may lose the balance, try to engage, very good. You can place your top foot on the front side, will help you to support more. Very good, this is how it is, okay? So let's start. Come to the plank pose, everybody. Drop the right palm in the shoulder or forearm down, up to your choice. Tilt your body sideways, very good. So your palm and your the center of the foot is in one line. You can place your top leg in the front or both legs over each other, then raise your left arm up, look front or up, choice is yours. Push your hips away from the ground, breathe, inhale, exhale. One, with exhalation, engage your core muscles, feel the obliques, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Drop the palm down, very good, and change. And this time, I show you this side, very good. Drop the left palm in the center, turn the body sidewise, very good, and then raise your right arm up. You can keep your top foot, which is right foot, on the front, very good, raise your arm up, push your hips away from the body. You can feel here this region, oh, very nicely, this is the oblique region. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good, drop the palm down, come to your knees and child pose. Normalize your breath, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Very good. One more time, we're gonna do the same thing. Very good, again, come to the plank pose. Drop the right palm in the center, tilt your body sidewise. Alignment, right palm to the center of the back foot. Very good, raise your left arm up and look up. Very good. Push your body away from the ground. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Very good. Change. Very good. Left palm down and right arm up. Very good. Shoulder over the wrist. Very good. Right palm up. Very good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Drop the palm down, lower the knees down, push your hips back, child pose, arms by the side of the body. Very good. This is counter pose. One, two, three, four, and five. And now, once you come to the yoga, and then one posture which is very important, which you would like to learn and you should learn, I will say, because in future it will help you a lot to interest in yoga, which is called Chaturanga. Remember, you love Chaturanga. If you hate Chaturanga, uh, yoga is going to be hard a little bit. Okay, so love the Chaturanga. Come to the plank pose here. Very simple, exactly a plank pose with legs slightly apart. Look forward and just you need to follow the Newton and go down towards the ground like an apple. Here, try to hold for a second and you touch down, no problem. Very good. But interesting is once you lift from the ground, this is what you need to learn here. One. Two, three, okay, down. This way you can try to learn it. Very good, try with me, everybody. Very good, press your palm down, press your toes down, lift your knees up first. Three, two, one, lift. Three, two, one, down. One more time, we'll repeat. Very good, breathe, inhale, exhale. One, two, three, inhale, lift, plank pose. 
sorry, Chaturanga. Three, two, one, press. Come to plank pose and push your hips back. Very good, downward facing dog. Now we will, this is now the end of the class and we will finish our class with the one strong inversion posture, which is very important for us and which can help you and you will be always interested. You always want to do that, okay? Before jump into the posture, it's straight your arm, finger separate, make a fist, and now rotate your wrist for five, four, three, two, one. Reverse, five, four, three, two, one. Now come quickly next to the wall. As I am right now, behind me there is a wall. Very good here. <laughs> Sit down against the wall, very nicely straight your leg here. Where is your heel or your ankle, there is your palm supposed to be. Okay, this is the measurement, how you will learn. Okay, here. If you can't remember this, basically you can remember easily. If you can't, so you can place this block here. Okay, you can put the belt here, and then you can remember. A little bit forward, backward is okay, no problem, not a big deal. Then cross your ankle, drop the palm down there, very good, and come to your hair in this kind of position. Now lift your one leg up here. Just you can touch your hips and your heel that much higher only. And then another leg. And then slowly push your leg and spread your leg. This is palm balance, look forward between the palm. Do not afraid, just do not move so much. If you can hold for five, four, three, two, one. That's enough. And then come down. This is our last posture, but we will repeat one more time, okay? So check carefully. Make sure whenever you're doing this posture, your finger is pretty separate first. If your finger is not separate, you may not able to use your arm strength completely 100%. So keep your finger separate properly first. Your palm's gonna be shoulder width apart. If your shoulder is tight, a bit more wider than shoulder, that is okay, no problem. Right here, as you check with the leg, right? Take your toes in, lift your knees up here, very good. Kind of a bend leg downward dog, you can say. Very good, now place your one leg up on the wall. You can see how much, where your heel can touch on your hips. This much higher only. Then take your another leg. Press your palm and you are already like a super person after a lot of planks, very good. And then push your leg. You can look at your toes, that is fine. Or you can look forward between the palm, both are fine. Press your palm, lift your shoulder away from the ground. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Come down slowly and drop the knees down and come to child pose. Counter pose, child pose, head down, arms by the side, head down. Normalize your breath, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, head up. So this is for today in this class, which is almost, almost about one hour class. Make sure this one hour class means always 50 minute of class or 55 minute of class because after once you finish the class, make sure once you close the video, then you lay down for five minutes or sit down for five minutes, I will say. That's gonna be always lovely. You need to remember this and you need to do it by yourself. So this is for today. Congratulations, you had finished another one hour of yoga class and I'm sure this will help you to practice yoga and stay healthy. If you think this video add any value in your life, in your yoga practice, and you had learned by this class something, and it helps you to practice yoga, and you want to support me and my work, so you can send me any amount from $1 to whatever else on my Google and Paytm accounts. The links are on the description. I will be happy to see your love and support that will help me, motivate me to make more video frequently, and I will be here for you, and I'm sure you will practice, you will love it. Thank you very much, your suggestions are always welcome. Let me know what else you want to learn, what next video you want to do, you want me to make for you, and anything else. Thank you very much, this is Dee. I wish you a lovely day ahead. Bye-bye.